Okay guys, welcome to the dam. This is about an hour from Konken, northwest. Depends on how you come here. <laughs> I suggest following the coastline of this huge reservoir. Be a little bit longer, it's a very nice drive though. Lots of places along the way to stop and, and check out. Restaurants, uh, coffee shops, things like that. This is the dam here. I'm looking at the boat. <laughs> but out on the reservoir, all kinds of fishing boats. See the temple up there? All kinds of fishing boats, right now anyway. But down through here, all in through here, is full of people just relaxing. There's restaurants and that down there. Uh, people are having picnics all over the place under the trees. I see a few people with barbecues even. Normally uh, that's not allowed, but it is here. There's two boats. I saw the little one and the nice big one. I didn't see the one with the house. That's a pretty cool idea, huh? Uh, nice golf course. I saw a dinosaur. He's, we have to go find him later. He's down over there somewhere. Like, for me, if there's water and boats, that's what I would go for. But all down through here, awesome place for, uh, for picnics. Probably over that way as well. I followed the coast all the way up and then we went around and came in the main gate. I don't know uh, how these people got in if they came in the main gate or not. There's roads all over the place. There's all kinds of stuff in here. You do have to go through security. Pretty intense security for a place like this. Uh, took a copy of, driver, of the driver's license and uh, we got a little card I don't know if it's a it kind of looks like a tracker but it might not be we have to give that back when we go out that's how they keep track of how many people was in there I guess that's a good sized boat huh two 200s that's what it looks like 200s good size Reservoirs are pretty low as you can see, huh? You think these black lines, this is the, just the start of the dry season. This thing will be dry in three or four months. See the black marks along here? That's a, be an extra, wow, 15 feet deep, I would say. Pretty deep. Oh, I, that's an awesome place to have a boat. <laughs> I'm gonna have lunch down here. It's oh, two or three o'clock in the afternoon, and uh, you can see the mats are out. People are gone, so I don't know if you can rent the mats from the restaurant or not. I have seen that in a few places where the restaurant will let you uh, give you a mat or serve you under a tree, basically which is pretty cool. It is so meticulously uh, trimmed, everything is trimmed nice and neat, you know, all the grass and the flowers and the bushes and you see the grass down through those trees. Maybe it's a part of the golf course, it certainly looks like it. Speed limit for your bicycle. As you can see, plenty of people here anybody that knows Thailand you know Thai people do not go outside during the middle of the day <laughs> you know and look at all these people here it, it's smoking hot and still the people are out checking it out I can't imagine what this place is like on the weekends this is the middle of the week middle of the day should be quiet <laughs> That's where we started. I'm gonna go down here now. 
have lunch, I guess. And then uh, check out some more of this. Check out this tree. It's alive. But I don't know why. <laughs> wow. So I had lunch. Four or five restaurants there together. Nothing special but cheap. <clears throat> now off to the park. It is insanely nice here. I say it's one of those places that's really busy early in the morning or just before dark. <clears throat> if it was closer to Konkan City, I'm sure it would be. It's pretty cool. Nobody in here. There's a dinosaur I was looking at through the trees. He's staring right at me. <laughs> Not as much in here as I was thinking. I had to go find something else. The farther I come in, the more I see. There's some people relaxing there. They're not tied. <laughs> Me being a man and a fisherman, I saw the lady doing something with the dress. <laughs> I thought it was a fishing net. <laughs> I didn't realize it was attached to a lady. <laughs> Oh, maybe she's making a fishing net. Professional photo shoot. Somebody just got married. Pretty cool. See what I mean? Don't that look like a big cast net? <laughs> Over here is a fountain. Oh, it's cool in here. Uh-oh. Now it's the dude's turn. It's a nice place for wedding photos, actually. It seems to be only just a bride and a groom. There's the back side of the dam. There's people over there, too. I don't even know how you get over there. Oh, those are the people cutting the grass. I was wondering why do they all have a blue shirt? They're all from the same company. They're the maintenance guys. There's people all over the place here. Right there. They got all blue shirts too. <laughs> and they're not with the maintenance company. All down through here, look at all these vehicles. There's a barbecue. Oh, there's a lot of people here. Lots of people. Nobody's swimming or nothing, though. Cool place, huh? And there's the, the fountain. And the lady getting her picture taken is right over there somewhere. It was. It's gone now. And one little girl. There's people everywhere. You know, this is Tuesday or Wednesday or something. Three o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> oh, there's a ton of cars over here. I don't know what that is. What's going on in here? Oh, this is a golf. It's a golf cart. Let me put your golf bag on and pull it. Here's a look at the golf course. The ladies in the pink shirt. They're the caddies. 
you get no option in that. You have to have a caddy in most on most Thailand golf courses, I believe. And it's normally a lady, but that's a dude right there. And maybe he is playing golf. <laughs> Here's the clubhouse, quite nice. It's a nice course actually. I don't know if it's nine holes or 18. It's big enough to be 18, I would think, but you know, it's only a guess. It's beautiful though. Down here, security. Got a couple pictures of securities. I'll put those in the blog post. It's not a big deal, but uh, it looks intimidating when you're coming in. Nothing to worry about football pitch I've shown before they have basketball here as well there's a lot of stuff here man security is way down there all right guys well that's it I'll put a link to the blog post in the video description I'll have pictures of the security on the blog post for sure and uh, if you want to see more stuff from Konken check out northeastthailand.com I'll have a playlist of all the videos made in the city and in the province on that page. Alright guys, as always, thanks for watching.